We drive through our lives with our sights in the rearview mirror, so focused on mistakes we've made that we unconsciously follow the wrong road. This road takes us in circles, yet we believe we're moving forward based on the fact the skies are changing, rain clouds create a thunderous sky of seamless darkness, and we continue moving in circles. We regret the decisions we make and we wonder why we can't remove ourselves from this vicious cycle. We don't consider looking up and making a conscious decision on which road will lead us to clear, beautiful skies. Living through the lens of regret is exhausting. We all have the capability to learn from our mistakes. Most of the time we do, but we always dwell over what is presently out of our control. We go to school every day and regret choosing this school while we should be making the most of the opportunities we do have. Daily, we remind ourselves of regretful decisions we have made and people we associated with in the past who helped mold who we are today. When we move on to post-secondary school or full-time employment, we don't want to regret having not put forth more effort in high school and not putting in the hours to earn ourselves a more rewarding career because the nights we needed to sit down and work, Netflix seemed more satisfying. We don't change a thing. We made decisions that have turned us into someone we didn't envision ourselves becoming. We don't change a thing. We lower our shields and succumb to peer pressure in order to seek acceptance. And when it doesn't come, we feel sorry for ourselves? We regret going against our morals for temporary validation, but we continue to make the same mistakes until we ask ourselves, how will I make a change? The answer is to think of life through a learning lens. Every decision we make impacts our life in some way. Sometimes our decisions benefit us, and we learn from the success to make more similar decisions. You can look at poor decisions the same way, using the fallout to make better decisions rather than something to stir over while you stare up at the ceiling at night trying to fall asleep. Another option is attempting to fix mistakes you have made. Whether you are successful or not, doing something about it will help you generate a sense of pride and closure because you know you have done what you can to lead you to the good in your life today. With this perspective, life will become more enjoyable. You will be more enthusiastic about what the future holds and assure yourself that you have made the right choices in your life. It is not only the things we have done that cause us to regret, but more so the things we did not do. The dreams we never chased because we were told to be realistic, not visiting your grandfather as much as you would have liked to before he passed away. Now let me ask you this. Where is the wealthiest place in the world? It is not China. It is not Dubai. It's the graveyard. Because in the graveyard you will find inventions never invented, businesses never erected, songs never sung, books never written, ideas never nurtured, people never realized because they were scared to take a risk. We still have the time to make sure our ideas and dreams aren't buried with us. Every passing moment we will never get to relive. It is up to us to make sure they are worth it.